he goes sex with Mushroom again. Uh, quite obviously, guys, unfortunately, I haven't done a video in approximately, well, a fortnight or so. But um, in comparison to that, I ought to say that there's particularly no comparison on that. Uh, well, in, well, no similarity whatsoever. I've actually started some uh, something new, which is... Um, as very many of you, uh, well, let's say few haven't heard of, uh, which is uh, Instagram. Uh, many people know about Instagram now. Obviously, obviously many people know about the uh, popular social networks such as that and um, uh, Facebook and Twitter and Google Plus, on which, uh, well, particularly um, Google Plus and Instagram, I myself am based. <coughs> but guys, I have to say about Instagram, uh, it's a very good um, social networking uh, media site. On which it's it's uh, there's particularly private information on there, so don't get uh, spreading much information. But um, it's particularly protected, uh, secure site really, and um, I mean there's no problems uh, involved in it, no bugs, no um, well obviously dilemmas on it so far. Uh, well, it's it's a very good um, application to get on your Android device or iOS device, on which obviously I got for my iPhone 4s here. Uh, guys, uh, yeah, it, uh, my um, Instagram is called Detecting Worcestershire, uh, which you quite, uh, quite um, obviously may have heard of, because this is the channel that I post on, that I've been posting on since uh, that of um, July the 27th, 2014, which is a good, very much almost uh, three quarters of a year uh, now. I'm um, sorry that I haven't actually done a video for approximately three weeks now. Uh, more than four night, quite obviously. But uh, there's not many Clod Up as Mel Detecting Club digs on. And I have unfortunately haven't been accepted to Four Quarters Mel Detecting Club yet. Yet, uh, the sequel to that of Clod Hoppers. Uh, a very much a similar detecting club in and around the West Midlands. And a lot nearer to where I live. Only half an hour away from most of the digs, fortunately enough. Uh, I should be accepted there in the not too near future, depending on if they have any spaces available. And if they hear it's detecting Worcestershire, well, obviously they'll make a quite a good exception for that. But um, yeah, guys. Additionally, I have to say, check out my Instagram. It's called Detecting Worcestershire. Uh, no capitals, just uh, detecting. Then a um, underscore, I believe it is. Yeah, underscore, and then uh, Worcestershire. Quite obviously. And uh, I've I've only done a couple of posts. I only started a couple of days ago anyway. But uh, unfortunately, I've got a lot of homework to do momentarily. As um, many of you may put into configuration, it is particularly hard and it takes a while and it's very time consuming. And that's why I can't do many videos. But um, <clears throat> guys, actually, additionally, I have to say, uh, what else is it to say actually? Yeah, guys, it's my my birthday's coming up. Um, to be exact, twenty eighth of March, two thousand and. 15, quite obviously. Uh, I'm not too particularly sure what to get. I may be getting a camera, uh, which it's either that of a Canon, of the beginner variety. Obviously, they're very expensive. You go to the professional or um, even to that of the intermediate range. But I'm just going for an amateur camera, not to that of a. I'm, I'm going to save up all my money for a brilliant amateur camera, such as the Canon T5, Rebel T5i, or that of the Canon 700D, which is in proximity to that £300. But uh, I'm going to have to save up a lot of my money, which I already have got £50 towards it so far. But when my birthday comes, that's all I really want. Um, I'm not. Now, you need to make this decision in the comment section below because I've not a clue whether to get that of a Canon 700D, which is obviously the Robert T5i, or that of a GoPro Hero 4, which on eBay, brand new, is in similarity to that of the region of the Canon 700D. But to make that decision yourself, just put it in the comment section below. Uh, it's I'll obviously very much appreciate that in any circumstance possible. And if you can do that, guys, uh, I'll be hoping for episode 9, 9 futuristically, then episode 10, the legendary number 10. Uh, then the unlucky number 13, futuristically after that, which will be somewhere in the range of winter this year, probably. It's going to be that long. But yeah, GoPro Hero 4 of the Black Variety. It's uh, no racism, racism involved there, sorry about that. Uh, I don't know why they call it Black, Silver and White Edition, it's just... Obviously, they're company names, and it's a particularly adequate name as well. But, um, yes, uh, GoPro Hero 4 of the Black Variety. I should be getting that, hopefully, or that of the Canon 700D, I've said previously. But uh, it's, it's a very good camera, I really have to say. Uh, it, it shoots in 4K at uh, a good, I believe, 30 frames per second, 1080p. 
60, and then that of 720 being 120 frames per second, which is really, uh, well, it won't be suitable or obviously an advantage for that of detecting. I mean, the GoPro Hero 3 would be fine, not if the early models of the Hero. But Hero 4 would be brilliant for melt detecting. I could have the macro lens on it and so on, and guys should just be able to see it in stunning high definition. And, uh, like, macro of the image and uh, a lot better stabilisation. I could strap it to my head, my chest, anywhere. But, uh, better detecting video soon. And, guys, I'd say, uh, in a bit. And detecting mushrooms always here, as I always say. But, uh, got a lot of homework to do momentarily. But, uh, other than that, guys, in a bit. <laughs>